my name is akil and welcome back to another video on the tech savior uh, so this is kind of a fourth installment on the topic basics of the flutter so on the first video on the basics of flutter i covered how to install or create these app bar on the flutter application in the second video i showed you how to install these icon buttons and on the third video i showed you how to uh, make an a drawer like this and on this video i will be showing you how to make a circle avatar and uh, actually install an image inside that circle avatar uh, so if you haven't watched the previous videos consider uh, going back and watching those videos because those are kind of a basics towards the flutter application you have to know those in order to get started with these uh, videos i'll be leaving a link towards those on the top of the video so go and watch those and uh, if you really like these videos consider subscribing and also uh, leave a like below so let us get started with the video uh, up till now we have only deal with the app bars everything every video on what i covered on the flutter basics was based on the application bars i haven't covered into the body of the scaffold so if you don't know scaffold what is scaffold watch my first video uh, so on this video onwards we will be uh, you know editing things on the body of the scaffold so uh, this area of the scaffold this is the whole app bar and this whole white space is known as the body of the scaffold so we will be installing an uh, circle avatar in the nearly center of this body so let's get started with that one and for that uh, start with the uh, parameter body you have to install these parameter inside the uh, scaffold function and uh, uh, in the flutter there is uh, a function on a circle avatar itself we are going to use that in order to make a circle avatar so uh, just by leaving that uh, function uh, we can see a small circle has been appeared out here and a couple of things that i'm going to do in this video is that i will be uh, you know showing an image inside this circle and uh, circle and also i will be uh, increasing the size of this circle and will be placing that in the center of the application so let us get started with that the first thing that i have to do is to uh, just give an image inside the circle avatar for that you have to call an uh, parameter inside the circle avatar which is known as a background image take the background image then you have to call in a function known as asset image so i have an image inside my asset folder so i will be calling that uh, function assets but uh, it is known as test dot sorry uh, test dot png so let us sync that and now we can see a small uh, man type of image has been appeared inside the uh, inside the circle of that so that's my image uh, i have put that image inside my asset folder if you don't know how to uh, show an image inside your flutter application just leave a comment down below i'll be also posting a video on that how to insert an image into your flutter application and uh, now the first part of the thing is two parts have been done we uh, did an circle of that also we did an install and uh, you know a background image inside that circle over there now i have to increase the size as this is a circle uh, you know to increase the size we increase the radius so inside the circle over there there is another parameter known as radius uh, give the radius of the circle we'll be leaving it as a 60 and it will enlarge the circle over there so two parts has been done i installed the circle over there a background image has been done and i have increased the radius now i have to uh, install this in the center of the uh, scaffold in order to do that uh, you have to know two things columns and rows and i'll be making on that videos uh, things on those uh, in the future so let us start off with those uh, first let me cut this from here now leave the body as an column column then inside that column leave a child widget and inside that paste your circle over there and the column uh, the column uh, function takes a parameter known as a main axis element main axis element dot center now it will leave my uh, circle in the center of the application uh, i actually need to increase the size of the circle it doesn't seems to be great okay let us go 10 more 
okay so it seems to be a bit bigger now now it is uh, the center in vertical fashion in vertically it is currently on center but horizontally it is not at the center horizontally it is at the left portion of the uh, app, app bar sorry it is on the left portion of the application you know to make it towards the center of the application horizontally you have to again uh, just uh, cut this or you can use a wrap a widget function i like to cut it so install a row function inside the column function then call its children widget and paste this inside that and then the row takes and function also the parameter known as main axis and main axis element dot center for the row to and uh, it will leave the circle over the, uh, the center of the application so that's it guys uh, that was a quick video on how to install as a uh, Install a circle over there inside your application and uh, some of the basic things inside the uh, body of a scaffold. Uh, if you need, I will be uh, posting more videos about explaining how the rows, columns, th those kind of things in the future videos. And uh, thank you for watching this video. If you haven't watched the previous video, I have a whole playlist on the basics of the Flutter. So uh, go ahead and watch those. Um, and uh, thank you for watching the video. Have a nice day. Please consider subscribing if you like the video.